127 years in business, the owners of a Buffalo furniture store say it's time for retirement and they're closing down after one final sale. Shearer's Furniture on Genesee Street is well known downtown and if you haven't visited, you've likely driven by. So two on your sides, Rob Hackford joins me now with more about their history. Hi, Rob. Yeah, hi, Kelly. A pretty iconic spot, really. My first time in this store, though, today, a lengthy history. Shears Furniture, as you mentioned, founded in 1897, actually started across the street from their current location where Catholic Health cur currently stands. But since the 1930s, they've called this spot at 104 Genesee Street home. Their old neon and porcelain sign there out front has been quite the calling card over the years. Their front doors are now decked out in some different signs. They're getting ready to close and having a big sale. Jim Shear, the current owner, is the fourth of five generations to work at Shear, starting with his great grandfather. He told me while closing is bittersweet, they've received a lot of love since announcing. Some of the letters and cards I've gotten have just been incredible. I've, I've had to get off the sales floor because I got so emotional, I just couldn't cope. <laughs> Um, a lot of good friends we've developed over the years. It's, it's been awesome. Yeah, Sheer added that his family has gone into other career fields and their building built back in the 1880s needs a good amount of work, so he's calling it retirement. They have found a buyer for the building with plans to enjoy the grandkids and explore a little bit himself. They're now trying to sell off as many things in the store as they can for as long as they can during a final closing sale. And whether a new or old customer, Shear says, he hopes that people will stop by. There's plenty to choose from right now. I think they've got a few more uh, days and weeks to come. No, no exact cutoff date. Okay. Um, but uh, he said to stay tuned to their, their Facebook page. We'll, of course, keep you updated as well. I bet you saw a lot of treasures today in there. Oh, my gosh. The fourth floor, kind of a hidden gem. Yeah. His favorite spot. Uh, it, it looked like a, a haunted mansion of sorts. He said some folks have seen ghosts. He personally hasn't. <laughs> so a lot of fun exploring today. All right. Thank you, Rob. Yeah, thank